what is going on youtube what's up creative crew it's your boy creative kenneth once again this week i just decided to bring you along in my mundane life you know sometimes we, we're just at home chilling in the garden doing chores fixing uh our troubles yeah we're not always outside spending money so yeah i just thought i'll, I'll give you some insight into the real life the mundane life so yeah it's fun though so come along yeah as you all know i my car stalled last week so i'm trying to get it fixed this week today actually and i need to replace my battery first thing first uh what happened was the alternator died at least from what we think so i went to walmart got a new battery and i'm gonna just put it in drive to my mechanic uh then they'll fix the alternator then hopefully i'll be able to return the the walmart battery that i've just bought because money hey money because yeah what i just need is to get the alternator fixed so it will be able to charge my old battery let's get it I was instructed not to use my radio or ace air conditioning on my way there and it's a hot summer day so it's gonna be a long 30 minutes ride oh my god the radio too i never listen to i never drive without listening to music but let's go get it let's go get it let's go get it so they give me a lexus place of my Toyota to go get a part I don't mind I don't mind but the wheel is so smooth I definitely need to add some power steering fluid to my Toyota wow there's our guy eee, it's heavy you gotta put it down alternator terminator accelerator the car is running out of gas, man. So I gotta get some gas. I am so hungry, so let me see if I can get something to buy. Just something little, man. So guys, I just got pulled over for by a cop. I literally have a heavy foot, man. I can't stop speeding. But he let me go with a warning. But I gotta be careful, man. I gotta be careful. It's funny how much you struggle with the, with the spanners and the pliers to try and remove that, those battery bolts. And the guy just came and removed it with, in one second with a drill. Hey, you just need to have the right tools to do stuff. I work smart. I'm getting tired because you can tell it's 3.40 p.m. I have to run errands, run around, and the car is getting fixed right now. Let's take a look. What's up, what's up, what's up? We done, the car is fixed. My money, my wallet is getting empty. Well, it's been empty, but it's been squeezed even more. But you know, let's just get the hassle in. And Jehovah Jireh will restore and replenish. But I'm just happy my car is, is, is good now. Now I can hopefully make more money. So, so let's get it. Bro, I just fixed my alternator. Then apparently the issue with the alternator caused the the, the battery to to die too. So now I, I had to I have to keep the new battery with that which eh hey, which even the English is going which which I thought I would I would I would be able to return and get the money back. And just as I'm driving away my AC light starts blinking and my air condition is not working. I'm telling you all when it rains it pours and it's pouring right now. Yo I'm so stressed right now it's crazy. I do not have money for a new car or another car. Watch out to one because apparently the alternator was not the issue. I bought an alternator. Uh, but I, <laughs> I have like three men working on my car and they can't figure out what the problem is. So let's see. 
as what a it abisa tumeanza kuintercede le rebe sikitikiribi hey hey it's crazy oh it's about to rain i told you when it rains it pours so i don't know i'm just to encourage myself in the lord they fixed the ac it was just a some plug something was unplugged probably as they were trying to put the new alternator in but um as for the they saying there might be still an issue with a wire somewhere but basically they said you just go with god and hope everything is okay um and hope your car doesn't die because they've checked everything the charges the fuses the fuse things and they're like something is wrong but we're not sure what and obviously don't have money for a dealership but it is what it is let me go with god so home and I am so tired and I want to sleep already even if it's still light out it's crazy but first I'm gonna watch a show then I'm gonna sleep hopefully don't sleep in the middle of the show because I have, I have sleep dead also from the past few days so maybe explains how tired I am yeah Apple TV have been doing this thing where they show you how do I put it? They, they, I've not, I don't have Apple TV, but they, they've been doing this thing where they are showing some shows which are premiering and you see the first few episodes for free. So I've, I've watched like four out of five of those shows, the first episode. They're pretty good. So I want, I want to watch the, the, the last one. And I'm actually tempted to pay for Apple TV, but thank God the, well, yeah. So I've been sent shopping and Leo have been giving us shopping list. I'm going to Aldi, which is the more affordable store to go to. So yeah, let's go have fun shopping, shop, shop around. I have not started this car since yesterday and I'm scared. So let's give it a try. Yes, sir. Praise the Lord. Chipotle over there is really really tempting. Anyways, so the shopping cart system here is actually very interesting. You can't get a cart unless you insert a, a quarter in here. So I forgot to carry a quarter and I had to borrow one. They gave it to me so let's go get it. I succumb to the temptation, so let's go eat. Oh, what is going on YouTube? How y'all doing? Yeah, so the purpose of this vlog is just to show you the mundane stuff of life. Uh, my week is not always, you know, fun stuff. But yeah, so, but it's fun. It's fun recording this, you know. I'm just just don't have to be any extra just gotta be me yeah so this guy jerry came to pick me up and show off his car and you know i'm just making him wait a little bit because uh yeah you remember what he did to me last time so you know revenge okay he's getting mad now so i gotta go yeah he packed so far away though it's like he's scared fool come here come back what are you doing come back here Jeez. <laughs> oh my god i'm done with this guy oh lie this man just bought the biggest drink in the world what the heck bro it's about to finish shut up get out of here <laughs> never buy an suv it's gonna kill you this 
guy is too extroverted, Mazi. He can meet anyone on the street and say hi. He can meet Rihanna and be like, my, my confidence is completely in the streets. Bro. So we're trying to rehabilitate an old car over here. Let's see. So we assembled a mule and more. Because the old ones, both of them died, but they're also really, really, really old. And yeah, I messed up one of them. <laughs> I'm responsible. The grass is growing really tall, so I'm gonna mow the yard right now. Yeah, it's about as tall as me, man. I'm like, if I wanna hide, I could hide in our grass because it's getting really tall. But yeah, I need to cut it. Alright guys, let's go do the mundane. Too. Yes, sir. Yes. Job done. The mundane, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we just got done with practice. We had practice for Sunday service this week, midweek. So, yeah, uh, the day is almost there. Champion. Champion. from the best. Learn from the best. Huh? Just came from bowling. I beat this guy so bad. How did I do, bro? Uh, the guy did quite good. Uh, but uh, when I say that, I mean from the side of training. So. He just felt terribly. He, had, he only had two cocks inside. Uh, is it not evil? Yeah, the, the, like the hockey thing is called a cock. Oh, really? Yeah, it's not a ball, a cock. That sounds so wrong. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, I'm, I'm terrible. And I had the rest. Nah, I think uh, they always should I'm terrible at this game, man. I don't think I've met a g <laughs> I've seen a game where I'm worse. But we keep on trying and improving. Hmm? I also started training on, on FIFA. Yes, sir. Man, give me two weeks and I'll be bad. Nice. What's up, YouTube? Man, welcome to the mundane. Woo. Just came from a long work day. Manual labor, guys. Ay. It's not for the week. So, yeah. I was working the whole day from like 9 to... Right now, it's like 6.30 p.m. So I'm really hungry, I've not eaten nothing the whole day. So I came to this place, it's called Slim's. And since I'm slim, I think I'm gonna have a good, a good meal. So yeah, let's go get it. again yeah uh well the mundane this we can do it it's about to get a bit less mundane we are gonna go for uh 
Youth Conference, Youth Weekend Challenge is a masterpiece. That's the theme. Um, yeah, so today it's nice outside, as you can see. We are in shorts, but yeah, it's gonna get a bit too hot later on, though. 90 degrees, yeah, but we're gonna be in the park playing, having fun. Yeah, later we're gonna listen to the word, worship. So, yeah, come along. It's gonna be beautiful. <laughs> Big back. Mm. <laughs> Let me tell you. Oh. <laughs> this is my diabetes. <laughs> we don't eat it every day. Mm. If we don't eat it every day, mm -hmm. it's from there. Amen. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the <laughs> channel. <laughs> so my car died again. <laughs> Look. Yep, there we go. Trouble, trouble. Towing part two. It's crazy, guys. What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Creative Kenneth. We're coming to the end of the vlog. Yep. I'm recording from home, as you can tell, in a very unprofessional position on my bed. Yeah, welcome to the mundane. But yeah, we're not always outside. We're not always in the fancy places. Sometimes we're just in our room, chilling. I just got home from a powerful weekend at JCC. Jesus Celebration of Center, the, the, the weekend challenge. Oh, man. I tell, tell you guys, you know, you know, you know, God can speak to you directly. Like he can actually like single you out and like speak to your needs directly. Man, it's been a, it's been a tough, 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 you need tough week. Yeah, I get a, I get a lot of, a lot of pressure when I tell people, uh, life is not so easy. And they'll be like, um, mm, you vlog say otherwise. First of all. I be talking about I try to you know I try to talk about to be honest about everything over here and yeah with my with the car and everything and like I said in the last vlog life is not always rosy for me or for anyone it's tough but again you know troubles are not always so vloggable when you're when you're when you're when your car breaks down and you're in on an accident your first instinct <laughs> It's not always to take out your phone and vlog. Sometimes mine is content creator. Is she more hard? But yeah, I mean, but yeah, life happens, but I have so much peace because I know God is in control and like God is speaking and I just trust him. Anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks so much. I appreciate your support. And also, yeah, I'll talk about what I wanted to say another day. But yeah.